It's the stuff that makes our pencil leads and our diamonds. It is also the basis for every living molecule. When I was a student, I was fascinated with carbon and its interesting properties in the crystalline form. Now that I actually touch them, it's like a dream come true. Every time a new material like carbonyl tubes is discovered, science take a leap forward. Being at the forefront of these technologies and being able to develop new materials that makes life better for everyone is fulfilling to me. From thermal dissipation, electromagnetic isolation, to weight reduction. If we can get these new materials right, the benefits across industries would be immense. The work I do is about breaking new grounds and challenging the way we address today's needs. How do we solve a problem if we are limited by current technologies? How do we build from the global community and when we have an idea, how do we build on it, test it, verify it, and recreate it? How do we guide our team and support them so that they are always performing at their best? But developing such solutions and getting people to use them are two different things. People are naturally uneasy around change and the unfamiliar. And sometimes, that's the biggest roadblock in technology adoption. So we have to be very targeted in how we approach the problem. Apart from the science, we need to understand what the actual needs are and convince people to take that leap of faith. One of the ongoing projects we are managing is Project P, converting used materials into biofuel which is extremely important for our road towards a sustainable tomorrow. Seeing new technologies adopted is what gives meaning to our work. My name is Danlin, I'm the Research and Technology Director and this is my life at Thales in Singapore. <laughs>